Several weeks ago, we put out a call for new members who may want to join with us in this strange moment. We were able to do some new member conversation over Zoom, and we had several show up and a few that are able to join. Three came in yesterday that were able to come with us, and so, just as we have done throughout this pandemic in terms of baptism, this is a moment in which that membership becomes real. Membership is a reaffirmation of baptism, so this is our moment to both hear them commit to us as we commit to them. So I'd ask that you join me in welcoming these new members. Friends, it is my honor and privilege to welcome new members into our congregation today. We have today, joining by reaffirmation of faith, Ryan and Megan Lane, and by letter of transfer, Paul Barnes. Beloved, the church is of God and will be preserved to the end of time for the conduct of worship, the due administration of God's word and sacraments, the maintenance of Christian fellowship and discipline, the edification of the believers, and the conversion of the world. Do you know that God loves you, that God's gift of Christ gives you salvation? Do you accept Jesus Christ as your Savior and Lord? As members of Christ's universal church, will you be loyal to the United Methodist Church, participating in its mission by your prayers, your presence, your gifts, and your service? As new members of Asbury First, will you do all in your power to strengthen this community of faith? Then I'd ask that you turn and face the virtual congregation out there. And this is a moment that is different than any other. This is our first class of new members, most of whom have been joining us by live stream during this time, though they may have had an opportunity to visit the church once or twice before this happened. But what a gift it is to know that we're still able to connect with one another in this strange moment. And given this strange moment, I ask that we trust and lean into the power and the work of the Holy Spirit in this moment. That part of what membership is, is a reaffirmation of baptism. And in baptism, we not only commit to the church, but the church, that congregation, commits to us. And so, wherever you are, out there, if you are able, I ask that you stand as we make this moment real, as we commit to one another, to these new members, as they are committing to us. Members of the family of God, I commend to you these persons, do all in your power to increase their faith, confirm their hope, and perfect them in love. We give, we give thanks, thanks for, for the faith God has worked within you. We, we pledge, pledge to you our, our Christian love and hospitality as those who also live by hope. Together with you and all Christians this day, we seek the unity of the Spirit in the bond of peace that in, in everything, everything God, God may be glorified through Christ Jesus. Amen. Amen. It does seem somehow fitting that just as in life, we don't always see the people who are committing to walk alongside us, but by the power of God's grace, we know that they are there. Blessed be the tie that binds. 